about to step up. You want 17 birds? Big ring, I play for the 17 birds. In my line, if you want 17 birds, big ring, I play for the 17 birds. I know a guy, if you want 17 birds, big ring, I play for the 17 birds. I know a guy, if you want 17 birds, big ring, I play for the 17 birds. Yeah, I'm from the 17. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. <laughs> 11 and 1. Let's play Swear to God. Lil Brunson back at you with the back at you, and I am the best reporting on the Eagles. Get all your hurt season merch, all of that stuff. You can link in the description. Let's play Swear to God. Say Swear to God you said that he couldn't throw. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people who look crazy right now. I predicted that this will come down to, you know, a passing attack by the Philadelphia Eagles. I predicted that we would have to throw the ball a day because it's a stingy team on the ground. And their main focus was to not let Jalen Hurts beat him. And, you know, Rabel is so disrespectful. I could tell in his face and in his tone. His mindset coming into this game was he going to have to show me that he could beat us with his arm. 380 passing yards, three touchdowns. Then your former guy, do you win? A.J. Brown, 100 receiving yards, two touchdowns. Smitty, 100 receiving yards, a touchdown. Jalen Hurts just showed you. First, first of all, the first team since the 81 Raiders, I believe, they have a 300, they have 350, they have 350 rushing yards. Then the next week have 350 passing yards. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Legitimately, the first team since I believe the 80, the 81 Raiders to have what is it? A hundred, uh, 300 rushing, 300 rushing yards. Then the next week topped it off with 300 passing yards. The Philadelphia Eagles are that team. We're absolutely that team, and it just can't be debunked at this point. You can't say that Jalen Hurts can't throw the ball no more. It makes no sense. The Philadelphia Eagles won this game in all three phases of the game. All three phases of the game were won by the Philadelphia Eagles. The defense, uh, sacks all over the place, great coverage. Now, we knew these guys were limited in the fashion of, you know, wide receivers, I guess. They, they just a limited ball club. They got nobody they could go to. You know what I mean? We shut down Derrick Henry, and we put those guys in tough situations. The Philadelphia Eagles are 11-0, and and we are inching closer and closer to where we want to be. Closer and closer to where we want to be. We absolutely want to be looking at getting that number one seed. And I feel really, really confident going forward. Just a fantastic game by all three units. Covey, let's talk about Covey for a minute. Covey was one of those guys who absolutely stepped up. Special teams stepped up after being completely abysmal, completely abysmal last uh, last week. They stepped up. They were terrible against the Green Bay Packers. Terrible. They were out there hitting. N'Kobe Dean was hitting. Covey was, you know, all over the place in terms of, let her go, Tori, she good. Covey was all over the place in terms of, you know what I mean, um, just being able to Get yardage for us and put us in some favorable matchups, man. We talk about AJ Brown and how and how difficult it might be to go against your former team. And when your former team knows you're going to get the ball, come on, man. We went out there and showed up and showed out, man. We showed up and showed out today. Smitty controlling the pace and being that guy for Jalen Hurts that outlet. It was a beautiful game. I really, really enjoyed watching this game. And it just was crazy, man. A beautiful game. I really enjoyed watching this game. The defense was hungry, man. Hungry. It's like it's like the defense was seeing fresh wounded meat across from them in the form of Ryan Tannehill. Fresh wounded meat in the form of Ryan Tannehill. And we were able to execute and exploit exactly what we needed to do on the defensive side of the ball. This, this is a good team we played today. We made light work of a really, really good team. Light work of a really, really good team. It's not a doubt in my mind moving forward that the Philadelphia Eagles are not the best team in the National Football League. NFC, that's easy. We're the best team in the NFL right now. We've been the best team in the NFL for a number of years. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, for a number of weeks. It's been just plain as day we've been the best team in the NFL. I mean, we got to kind of look at what's going on with the Giants and the, uh, and the Washington Commanders, but who really cares? Dollars probably going to fold tonight. You know what I'm saying? All that matters is that it comes through Philadelphia. For the next three weeks, we're going to be on the road, though. We got the Giants, the Bears, and I think we got the Dallas Cowboys Christmas Eve. Well, yeah, that's the next three games for the Philadelphia Eagles. So we won't be home for a while. So this will be a test. This will be a test. But I got to address the penalties, man. Listen, the Christmas album, cool, is selling out and all of that. 
But guys thought they was really on tour selling records instead of doing a real job, which is, you know, playing offensive line for the Philadelphia Eagles. I know Stoutland is going to have a lot to talk about, you know, in terms of that. But Jalen Hurts did a phenomenal job as the leader of this football team, overcoming all of those things. It was a lot to overcome. We were we were in some favorable and in, in some unfavorable situations a lot during the course of this game due to the penalties pushing us back. But Jalen Hurts still was finding ways to convert with his arm, not running. They took the legs away from him. Everybody want to disrespect our quarterback and say, here, running back. No, they took the legs away and they got picked apart through the air. It's, it's no way you can guard this guy, bro. He's like Kobe in his zone. It's hard to, it's hard to guard Jalen Hurts. You, you, you want to take away the run? The arm is just as good, y'all. The arm is just as good. Stop acting like it's not, man. You will save yourself a lot of heart. You will save yourself. Stop playing yourself. He good. We ain't got to lie about it no more, y'all. It is what it is. Let me know what you think in the comments, man.